Hey, crew, how are you? Welcome back to another episode of Animal Crossing New Leaf. I'm sorry there was no intro today. Uh, so, let me let me explain this. So, for those of you guys who don't know, I have a dog, and uh, she has what is called a collapsible collapsible esophagus. I think is I don't know what the the technical term for it is, but pretty much what it means is if she gets excited, uh, it can be hard for her to breathe. And at the start of my last video. She decided that uh, she was going to start doing the thing where she like chokes and I was like probably shouldn't leave that in the video so <laughs> Oh man, what a start to today, but I hope all you guys are having a great Tuesday for those of you that like the intro uh, If you listen it is March 28th 2017 current time is 408 or was 408 p.m. And we had two announcements from Isabel one was that our new town person moved in for those of you guys who don't know that would be the one the only bangle bangle moved in and then we also have a event today of the opening of the new supermarket so we have a couple things we need to get done today um i did find one fossil during the intro before the dog started choking and uh yeah i think that's it i think that covered everything is there anything else going on today there was no mail um, yeah, I think we're good. I think that covers it. We do need to get my hair. Sarah Hera is here. Hold on, start the stitches though. Sodded. Oh, it's Rick. Hey there, stuffing. No, oh, so what can I do for you? What's up, my dude? Oh, water is like food for flowers. So, so, uh, whatever. I water them. I like to pretend I'm serving them a uh, helping of potato salad. That's kind of screwed up. Not gonna lie, stitches, because potatoes are. A vegetable comes from a plant, so technically, you're you're feeding plants plants, but whatever, it's cool. Potato salad, my dude. We got another fossil. So the reason we we're finding gyros today, like I said before, I recorded uh, yesterday. I played in the morning and it was raining, so that's why we we're finding gyros. Hello, I'm Sahara from far away. Yeah, let's see what uh, let's see what you got today. Three thousand bells. I'll do it. We must travel to your place swiftly. All right, let's go. Sprint, you camel. Boop. There we go. How much money do I have on me? Am I going to be able to go shopping today? I know I paid off that one uh, bill I had for the house. Wait a tick. <gasps> it is open. Oh, I see the harmony of this room. Just the thing. Yes, I forgot we put in the other room. Oh, I can see it in the corner where like the you can kind of see the hallway behind the Triforce. That means I have to move some stuff around though. All right, Sahara, go for it. Do your work. Do your worst. I love this. The only thing I wish that was different is like in the old cartoons. You guys know when like there's something going on in the house, it'll like the house like stretches and moves around. I, I kind of wish it did that, but it kind of gives that same effect by the camera shaking, but. All right, she gives us back our old flooring and wallpaper. My vision will grow on you like a stray hair. Pluck it, I must go. Wait. Did she, doesn't, wouldn't that mean to take down the old stuff that I don't like? Let's see, what did you give me this time? Is that cheese? Did, did you make my floor out of cheese? Or is that supposed to be the moon? I swear this is cheese. Hold on. Cheese floor. And I actually think this is the sky wall. I wonder if that's exactly what Annie gave me. Hold on, let me look. <clears throat> I think that's the same flooring that Annie, or the same wallpaper that Annie gave me. No, I guess they're a little different. Yeah, they're definitely different. That one's like if you're looking from a plane. This one's like you're on the beach looking out to the water. With the blue sky in the background. Okay. Um, well, since we have it, we may as well... Oh, dang it. I didn't mean to take that down. Uh, put my Yoshi egg back. Yoshi egg. There we go. We'll move these over here. And... Oh, dang it. Come on. Push it back a little bit. And the Triforce is... Or not the Triforce. The sword. Is that one space or two? It's one space. Okay, cool. And this is our new room, guys. 
Uh, it's gonna be super small. 298,000 bells for this. This is the same size of our first house that only cost us 10,000 bells. Inflation. It's a thing, I guess. And I'll add some cheese flooring. <laughs> eh, I don't know what we're gonna do with that room yet. Like I said, I want to do all the rooms, like the, the one in the back, the one on the right side, and the basement before I start upgrading the size of them. So, for now, that will be our cheese and sky room. That's not weird at all. Yeah, Sahara, it sucked. Enjoy my 3,000 bells. Okay. Um. Well, we could go say hi to Bengal. Alright, let's go see Bengal first. Oh, dang it, I ran through my tulips. We'll visit Bangle, see how she's enjoying Yulison so far. And then we will go downtown and... Oh, it's a pink roof! Her house is really cute. I kind of wish you could make your house look like the villagers' houses. Hi, Bangle! Oh, what a cool room. The citrus floor and then the flowers. It's like she's got her own little jungle in here. Hey, Rek. Sorry it took me so long to get uh, together to move to Yulison. I mean, you totally told me to move into town when I was camping, remember? So, I didn't. Look, I gotta spend some time straightening up this mess, but let's try to have a scheduled playdate soon. Look at that. Her little shirt matches her wallpaper. I like Bengal. She's cute. Okay, so. Operation Get Rid of Paula and Miranda is still in full effect. So, we can get two more awesome villagers similar to Bengal. All right, to Main Street. You know, there's times when I do this LP that I really just want to shut up and not talk so you guys can listen to the amazing music. Because um, I think Animal Crossing is one of the best soundtracks out of any game I play. Um, I think I think it's Wild World had really good music. I, I like this one's music too, but it's just so good. Every hour has different music. If it's raining, it's different. Yo, Rex, snort. So, what's up? Not much. How you been, Humphrey? Uh, Humphrey? It's fun to come shopping district and meet new folks, don't you think, snort? I mean, yeah. I guess so. I never really meet new people, considering everyone in my town goes here, but whatever. And welcome to TNT Mart. Mira's here. Welcome, welcome! Welcome to the grand opening of Super TNT. Come on in. Oh, I wanted to let you know, we've added space for items that can hang on walls. You can find it by looking at the back of the left store, uh, back left of the store. You can't miss it. How decorative. So, they will now have three items for sale, and then on this back wall, they will have one hanging item. Uh, minimalist clock. I never understood that. Why well, have a clock that doesn't have hands on it? I mean, I guess you can still kind of tell what it is, but I don't know. Mildly infuriating. The outdoor bath. I'll take it. I'll probably give that to a villager. I don't know who, but... Someone, somebody likes an outdoor bath. Hi, Mira. Hey, hey, it's Rick. Oh, the grocery shopping or something, Cottontail? So, is there something that you need from me? How you been? The products of the supermarket change every day. It's amazing, Cottontail. I mean, yeah, it is a supermarket. All right, so, I have to buy two of these because they were closed yesterday. So, I'm going to need to shake my 3DS. Don't let me forget comment section. Make sure uh, you leave a comment saying to shake my 3DS and you have will have a chance of being on the list of people announced tomorrow when I record this episode. So, yeah, do it, do it. If you like having shoutouts in videos, now is your time. Alright, episode 25. Will you be the one that we finally get a losing ticket? Survey says... Hey, there's a fortune inside. Let's see. He who stubs his toe remembers his feet are there. That sounds like a loser. And what's this one? There's a fortune inside. Sometimes a flower is just a flower unless it causes fire. So I'm guessing that's a fire flower for the house? From Mario? Our shop does not offer a point system. I don't understand. What is it the final upgrade that is finally uh that we finally get the point system? Like he keeps talking about it. You would think they'd upgrade to a point system three times after three times of upgrading. <gasps> We didn't win! That was the ticket from day 23! That was yesterday's fortune. Wow! We got the groovy wall though. So mark that down guys. Episode 23 was the very first fortune we ever got that was not a winner. Feels bad, man. Alright, and we'll turn in our other ticket, which I'm positive is a winner. 
It is a fire flower. So there we go. Watch, it's not a fire flower and I'm an idiot. Let's see here, number 20. Aha, congratulations, the prize winner 20 is a fire flower. Cool. I could, uh, I need to get another question mark, question mark block. Because I think it's really cool to like have those things popping out of the question mark blocks. The laboratory wall, what does that look like? That looks like a dungeon, that doesn't look like a laboratory. Well, I mean, I guess who you ask, laboratories could be considered dungeons. It's a modern wood wall. Show it to me. What do you got? Eh, I'm not a fan of that. Looks like plywood. Ah, the plush carpet. Plush carpeting? Uh, no. I feel so bad, dude. There's so many cool furniture sets in this, but I'm so damn picky. The nine times out of ten, uh, the plank tatan ta tatami, plank tatami. What is that? I already have this. Yeah, I got that at the house. All right, we're out of here. Excuse me, Mira. So I shove her into a freaking shopping cart. Uh, okay, so the item that's up there, you guys may have noticed it, uh, the megaphone is a tool item that you can buy similar to a shovel or a watering can. And what it does is it allows you to like say a villager's name into your 3DS, and if they're outside or anywhere near you, uh, they'll hear it and come to you. It's a really cool feature, uh, I just never use it, so I don't buy it anymore. That is an axe. No, I don't need an axe. I do not plan on doing any murders today, Leaf. Thank you for asking, though. Okay, we'll take our sapling. 60 bells. I'll take it. Thank you, thank you. So I wonder what we have to do for our next upgrade of TNT Supermarket to, I think it's uh, Nooklington's is the next one, which is the final upgrade. I should look that up. I know I have to buy a certain amount of stuff, but in the old games, it used to require someone from another town to come and buy something from your town. I don't know if that still exists. If it does, it's not a big deal. Like, I have other friends that play Animal Crossing, so they can come to my town and buy something. But, I do wonder. Alright, let's get our hair done. Let's get our hair did. I'm gonna try this again. Hopefully, I don't end up with the muffin hair again. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know, Harriet. Listen here, you piece of crap. This is how you make all your money, huh? You give really bad haircuts, and then you expect me to come back the next week, next day, and get it cut again. Update the look of new hairstyle, then just leave it to me. 3,000 bells, yeah, I know. Alright, just hold on to the belongings for a moment. Look at how stupid we are. First, tell me how you're overall you're looking for. We're gonna go like somewhat casual. I see, pretty casual then. Casual mare. I love it. Sounds approachable. Different kinds of casual, though. Do I deal loose or wavy? Loose and wavy. This isn't wavy. This is a muffin. I have one more question for you. A loose style, you're thinking I'm loose feeling a charming or laid back guy? The guy with cute girly stuff, afraid of showing it. Laid back and loose. I see. You like your hair to be loose and lazy, then. Okay. Control your picture of the hairstyle now. Now, then. You need to pick out a hair color. What color really speaks to you? I still want to be blue. Okay, what about the following? I want to be the deep sea. Understood. Now, know exactly what you want. Let's start the styling. Please. Be like a cool, kind of shaggy blue hair. Hmm. Ta-da! Yeah, it looks fabulous and totally different. 3,000 bells, please. I freaking love it. This is the look I was going for before. Nice! Finally, we got good hair. I know some people are going to be like, why do you like blue hair? I don't know. I like the color blue. And, uh, yeah. I don't know. I think it looks cool. And I like how it, like, sticks out from the hat. I'm sure some of you guys are surprised how long I've been wearing this outfit, but I really like it. So unless something really cool comes up, I think I'm going to pretty much keep this the same. I'll probably still buy clothes here and there uh, in case we need it for something, but it doesn't look like they have anything. Hey, Rack, welcome. Uh, if you like to use a sewing machine, let me know. Nope. You may not know this, but people are known to slack off the most on Tuesdays. It's true. Uh, as a seamstress, I'm going to make a mistake. You can bet your buttons it'll be on a Tuesday. Mother used to say that like it was uh, some sort of ancient wisdom. 
Huh, I wonder if that's true. In my opinion, I think most people would make mistakes on a Thursday because they're thinking about how close they are to the weekend, but who knows? Is this a backwards hat? What is this? Oh, it's a bandana. Yeah, no, I'm gonna pass on that. Uh, not interested. I can get a Bob Ross wig. Yeah, I'm gonna buy this Bob Ross wig just in case uh, we ever need it for, you know, some kind of special occasion. But uh, I'll buy it, you know. Alright, anything I need there? Nope, steampunk goggles, clown mask. It's not really a clown mask. What would that be? A disguise? I guess it'd be considered a disguise. All right, we can check kicks. Whoops, sorry. Oh, I just took a chunk out of his front door. I, he won't even notice, right? Zap boots are in again. He still has, I wanna see, are these considered armored shoes? They are armor shoes, or the historic style. Oh, uh, let me try them on. Can I actually see them? How do you feel now that you've got them on your feet? If you want to buy them, it'll be 960 bells. I'm going to buy these. Cha-ching, chum. I don't like that you call me chum. I'm going to be real with you. That's not very nice. I'm offended. Okay. So, we can take these. I don't know. Just in case we ever get, like, a knight in shining armor set, I'll have the shoes for it. And I'm not going to be like, oh, I could have bought those and I didn't. Oh, man. I must be recording early today. Blathers is still asleep. Ooh. Jolly good. Oh, good dear. Pardon me. Welcome to the Ulysses Museum. Hmm. How many have you of service? We have a couple of fossils for you to check. I didn't get all of them yet today, but whatever. It's not like any of them are ever freaking new anyways. There you go, bud. Oh, more than one I see. Let's take a closer look. Oh, I do believe I found something that's not yet part of our museum's collection. It's really most stunning, I believe you have a natural town for fossils. I'm rather jealous. Okay, so at least one of them are new. Maybe we'll get lucky and complete a dinosaur with this, and then he'll, like, start to tell us something about it. Let's see. Yep. One of them, it was the patchy torso. There you go, bud. What? Could this be your donated patchy torso? Very glad to accept your donation. You have my thanks. If only we had the other pieces of the creature to be completed. Dang it. Nah, eh, whatever. It's not the end of the world, but thank you, Blathers. You can go back to bed now. Thank you, thank you, my dude. Alrighty then. So, all of our shopping is done and out of the way. Hamfrey's still hanging out. Um, I could get some fruit. I don't have any fruit on me. So I'm going to go sell these items I have. We will grab a snack for our favorite salamander. And we'll see if we can get a new emote today. I'm hoping to get kind of like an angry emote. I don't know if there is one. Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I wonder what we should feed him. We gave him an orange yesterday. Let's find him a peach. I'm sure he'd like a peach. Oh, there's one right next to uh, retail. Okay. Hi, Reese. Hello there, welcome. Yes, can I help you? I would like to sell some crap. Sell something to you, what did you bring in? Uh, the common wall, you can have a sapling. Oh, I don't wanna sell the fire flower. The groovy wall I wanna hold on to. I just bought the outdoor bath, okay. Common floor you can have. Yeah, you can just have that stuff. That's everything, I'll start crunching the numbers. Well then. I could probably part with 2,473 bells. Sure, that's way more than I expected to get. All right, oh, that's cool. It's like a studio light. I want this, because we're gonna make a streaming room in the house. A small spotlight. How is that a small spotlight? Thank you for your purchase. Yo, that's so cool. I actually really like that. Yeah, I wanna make a, a streaming room in the house where it's got like a computer and all that kind of stuff set up. Maybe we can find green wallpaper, so it's like a green screen, and then we can put studio lights up. I think that'd be really cool. We'll probably do that in the attic. Alright, we'll grab our peaches. You ever notice that peaches look like butts? So technically, you're eating a booty? Like grocery... Oh, kill me. I'm sorry I made that joke. Hi, Stitches! Buddy, I gotta, I gotta get by. I know, I know, you wanna hang out, but I got other stuff I gotta do. 
I gotta go see Shrunk. My boy Shrunk. Shrunk the Hunk is what they called him in high school. Before he decided to be a comedian and give up his life of bodybuilding. Um, but there we go. What do you got for me, Shrunky? I need to find a day that I can record at night so that you guys can see uh, KK Slider. I brought you a snack. Huh? Really? Oh, that makes me so happy. What do you bring me? I brought you one peach. One butt. Eat the butt. Oh, I can't see it because I'm blocking. Don't mind me. As I eat the booty. Whew! That was quite satisfying. Well, thanks a bunch. I should probably return the favor now, shouldn't I? Hmm. Then how about I tell you a really good joke? Alright. I have to get ready first. Wait right here. I will wait for you, buddy. Thank you, thank you. Dr. Shrunk is in the house. My pride joke is just the thing to cure what ails you. So, I remember this really funny joke my teacher used to tell. Oh, do you want to hear it? <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. Just thinking about it makes me laugh. Well, are you ready to hear this great joke? There are two kinds of people in the world. Those who can count, and those without. Oh no, I messed up the joke. <laughs> I mean... I guess that is two kinds of people in the world. What do you think? It's my first time I've seen the pride joke. So you can add one more into your joke book. The pride ability for your comic skills. So, this is the new ability we got today. Look at that. Look at that pose. Huh, I like it. It's not like an angry like I wanted, but that is still a useful, uh, useful little emote there. Alright, well, let's see if there's anything in Nook's homes that we can uh, add to our brand new house. What do you got for me today, Nook? Oh, welcome, welcome. Oh my goodness, it's Wreck. Good. Hmm, your addition is finished. Hmm, Wreck, my friend. Your home is much homier now. Yes, yes. And it's time for business numbers. Yes, the traveling cost 348,000 bells. Oh, no, no, no. I can't accept your money here. 348,000 bells, my dude? That's so expensive. Um, I kind of like this. The white exterior is a sample of renovating your exterior walls. Hmm. 5,000. You know, we're going to do this. The yellow's cool and all, but it doesn't really go that well with the blue, so we'll take care of that. Be a nice little home upgrade for tomorrow. Okay, well, I think that just about covers everything I want to do in Ulysses today. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. Uh, let's see if we can hit... Uh, what's our like goal going to be for the day? Let's try 12. That's more than normal. It's way more than I normally ask for, but yeah, let's see if we can do 12. If we crush that, maybe we'll set a higher goal next time. I want to see how many likes we can actually get on these, on this daily series. But thank you guys so much for watching, like always. I will catch you tomorrow for another day in Yulison. Oh wait, let me show you guys the fire flower real quick before I forget. Boop! There you go. Oh, let me spin it. Turn it. Turn it. There you go. So we got a fire flower and our star. But uh, I will catch you guys tomorrow. All right. Peace.